Welcome to Mercenary Field here in Chirac, Illinois, home of the Midway Mutants. Also home of the White Schlocks and the Flubs. Also home of the most state politicians in Jail Hall of Fame. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The Purple Mutant Eaters go up against the Midway Mutants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Hi, everyone, Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Bricks, do you smell something burning? Ah, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the toaster oven to warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Oh, ah! Uh-huh, it's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo, stick your head in the toaster oven. That'll warm you up. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. The defender says it's... And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest, the greatest, I tell you. <laughs> First and eight to go. Oh, I love this dirty trick. Feet by Fo Fum, stomp him into the ground. At this point, with multiple interceptions, he's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Second down and six. Roid Rage ignites that deep down violent rage and makes you unstoppable. I'll take a Roid Rage with a vodka chaser. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Brex. Uh, goodnight to that guy, Brex. You're an idiot. And that guy is dead. Good riddance. He killed me in my fantasy game last week. I wonder 
wanted to murder him myself! Dancing like a zonked out jam band enthusiast. Oh, that's how he spends his entire off season! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Second down and five. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Third down and, well, good luck. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the... Oh, and that's what you call a killer one-hitter, folks. I did a killer one-hitter once, and an ungrateful undead riot fest. I woke up with three guys gnawing on my kneecap. And it's first and ten. Pullman about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got dead mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. Second and three. Third down and eight. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Briggs. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Nelly, offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Mama, just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> the offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. 
The defenders want to see just kicked in. He's out. And he finds open space is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. Now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called, it goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. The ball lasers through the defense, cutting a defender in half. But that means you can wrap up the other half and save it for later. And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. Second down in a very lot. One. And the defense falls for that trick all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field. Literally. Third down and the punter is warming up. One. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. First and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot he was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, at the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Third down and five. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Well, it's a fair question. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. If you don't 
don't think he can make the interception. Batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Third down in forever. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know why. And he just slipped away like a Greek pig. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. And the defense is on his heels. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this cute. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And it's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Give this guy a few catches. And bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Hey. Oh, look at this guy break. And they run it for a couple of yards. Third and two. And get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. That's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and he's Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Second and three. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And 
Saints, first and ten. Looks like the defense called the ginormous dirty trick. That's a whole lot of player right there. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. The offense is running low on receivers. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> at this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel, and he's off to the races. He's at the 30. He might catch him. Move, you fat little Milton. That's a touchdown-saving tackle right there. Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense called plays. He caught it. And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. They want more points, so they're going for two. The offense screwed up that play, Bricks. Had never had a chance, Grim. Never had a chance. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry-up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, and he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. <laughs> and that's why we love the MFL. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the offense is down to their final receiver. They'll be playing shorthanded for the rest of the game. Uh, and if they lose him, will they have to forfeit? Uh, talk about pressure. I'm going to have to take the value before this one ends. Hey, you hold it out on me. And it's first. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? Can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, nah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, nah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Yeah. Well, yeah. either that or kill and cheat more. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And like Brick and the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest.
tits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest tits? Wham! And it's first and ten. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. And I'm not sure who he was throwing to on that play. Second down and ten. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. There are no more receivers, so it's game over next time the offense takes the field. If the other team punts, that's the game, right, Grim? That's right, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And he breaks away. It's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. The Midway Mutants destroyed the opposition today. There's no one left to play, so they win by forfeit. It was a decisive win. The home crowd is cheering and at the same time. Too much excitement and booze will do that to you. And the players are celebrating as they search for missing appendages. They left it all on the field today, or most of it anyway. Oh, you're not kidding. The blood and gut sucking Zamboni is coming out now. Hey, if anyone needs a liver transplant, there's a nice looking one down on the 40 yard line. And let's hear what the MVP has to say. Oh, I can't wait to hear what the most valuable brickhead has to say. Blah, 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 you suck. You take my fantasy game last week, you douchebag. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...